Hey guys, so today I am going to reorganize my vanity thing. Cause yeah. Today I'm going to reorganize my vanity situation. I'm going to show you guys my full process because I'm really excited about it because it's a hot mess. The girls are here. Greg is here. Um, so let me show... Let me show you guys what I'm looking at. Yeah, so this is just <laughs> junk. Here's what we have going on. Usually, I'm not gonna lie, it's sometimes this bad, sometimes it's not. There's like my bonnet stuff, wigs, makeup from like a few days ago, like electronic stuff. It's just a hot mess up here, my brushes, and then some of Greg stuff winds up getting up here. Just stuff. And then of course, you guys see this in other makeup videos. All of my makeup is in here and it's kind of like a mess. So none of these are like organized anymore. This is so none of these drawers are like as organized as they used to be. Stop Zara. So I need to organize these and deal with this situation. I have to organize this and get rid of all these things. So I need to organize all this stuff and put it into a new Alex drawer situation so I have to build this I'm gonna build this by myself build this by myself and then we'll start organizing show you guys how I'm going to go ahead and organize this because it's a hot mess and they're really loud and I'm gonna show you guys the containers I'm going to use in everything so let's get okay, so I have all these pieces organized by the drawer front so I have them organized by the drawer front, the side pieces, these big pieces. These are the main side pieces, Zara. And then these pieces over here, which I have no idea. And obviously the little jigamadigs and the instructions. I put this one together myself. I just don't remember. It's been so long. And I think I put, no, I think Greg did one of these upside down. That's why it speaks. I think it's this one. He put in wrong. But it still works but yeah so i did do this one no he put this upside down so i think i'm gonna take this one down take this apart and like fix this because this is the actual bottom of the thing i don't know he did something wrong so i'm gonna fix this one too but here's all the pieces we're gonna go ahead and get this together I do recommend just using a regular screwdriver to do these bits here. I have this one from Ikea, which I do love. It's just, it makes it hard to do this because you can kind of mess up, um, which I almost did on one of those down there. Using the screwdriver made it go by a lot faster. I just did this in like five minutes, maybe 10. But I think I like using the little drill better um, than the screwdriver because with this one, I use a screwdriver and a hammer and it took us like 40 minutes to put this one together. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the top, the bottom side, and then we can work on the drawers. Okay, so the whole thing is good, top and bottom. Now remember what we did wrong on the other one. Um, Greg put the bottom one at the top, and see the bottom one has those like, these little nail tops that kind of stick out right there. And those are scratching my table under here. So I'm just gonna switch those two on this one so now I'm just gonna work on the drawers here which is really really easy and then I'm gonna stick them in. excuse me can you move <laughs> okay so this one's the new one it's done finally here's the old one so now I have to take all this stuff out because I have to you see how Greg did me y'all he put this this is the bottom piece it needs to go down there so I have to switch these two. so in order to switch it, I need to take everything out because I have to turn it upside down. Excuse me. See, this is what I have to do with. This is why I'm trying to clean this area up. Give me my stuff. But I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna show you guys what all this stuff looks like once it comes out. But let me go ahead and switch these two and then I'll be back because she's a hot mess in there. Thank you. 
so this is everything that minus this that was in that guy and it may not look like a lot but i got rid of a lot of stuff so you may not see some stuff that you'll see in my makeup vanity um tour which i will link up top but this is pretty much all the makeup that i own now um that was in this guy and as you can see look how dirty this was so i need to clean this out as well so let me go ahead and switch this They are finally finished. Now I have to remove everything from up here because I have to take the legs off the table and fix that situation back there. what I came up with um because this thing is like a I have a clicker to this so it turns the lights on and off with the clicker so that's why I have that extension cord into that to go into both of the lights here and then I just kind of cleaned up the cord to my ring light just wrapped it around just for now until I can find a better way to handle this situation and then I'm going to plug Greg's phone thing up somewhere else but this is kind of what I have going on I just used some tape I don't know yeah I think I couldn't find any zip ties so I just used tape So this is what we're looking like it looks 10 times better the hardest part is lining these two up with the table and the good thing is that ikea with the alex Shore set give you like these sticky things let me show you you stick it onto here and it kind of keeps the table from like sliding because without these this tabletop would literally just move and as you can see it's like wiggling and that's because I only had if you don't stay I only had 
the four that came with the new one because I lost the old one. So let me go ahead and wipe off the table. I did break my bookshelf, so now I have to fix that because the back is all broken. Um, yeah, and I waste all the trash on the floor. So I'm going to go ahead and wipe the table off and start trying to transfer some of this stuff into these drawers in a few minutes. All of this stuff, including that, this, and then there's like lipsticks and Zara's crit and Zara's thing here. So all this stuff have to go in these two things are on the table. So let's go ahead and get into it. So originally I went to, what was the store? The container store and bought all these containers. Let me show you. I bought a whole bunch of these containers. I don't know if you guys can see these. And I bought these from the container store when I first set up my vanity and I love these. And I went and bought about eight of them and it was like $65. So I decided to take them back and that's why I still have the bag. But I went to Walmart and I found these and it was seven pieces for five bucks. So I am going to use these guys to organize, I think the skincare side and the electronic side and hair stuff. And I got these also from Walmart and they were 98 cents each and you get two and this one and you get three and this one, all of that stuff from the container store today because I was like that makes no sense to spend that much when I can get okay ones from Walmart and honestly no one else is going to see this except for you guys now and me every day and if you want to go to Dollar Tree and get them they're a little bit flimsier and then you're paying a dollar for like maybe two or a dollar for maybe one so I just suggest to go to Walmart okay so the first thing is I'm gonna go ahead and do all the makeup and then I'm gonna move to the skincare so Let's hurry up and get this over with. I'm exhausted. First, I'm gonna organize all the makeup. I forgot that I need to organize everything because there's some old stuff in there and some things that's been like emptied. And then I'm gonna organize everything and then make sure I know what I got. Then I'm gonna put it in there. So let me organize first. <laughs>
okay guys it's been a long freaking day to the point i even took my wig off a long time ago guys i couldn't film me organizing every drawer because i was so confused on where i wanted stuff that i could not figure out how i wanted it and still try to get good film because i was trying to make sure that you guys were seeing everything and i kept changing my mind but i'm going to show you how they turned out on the end i don't even I don't even think you guys got to see how the drawers looked in the beginning like the first makeup drawers but it turned out so good guys it looks so much better the shelf is officially gone with all that junk on it there is a bin down here that have all my leftover acrylic organizers i'm going to keep them because i'm probably going to use them when we do finally move if not then i'll probably sell them or give them away then but they're just gonna be there because i'm gonna start packing soon because we are gonna move i just don't know like what all we're doing but i'm gonna leave them there my trash can but i was able to hang up my diploma my degree again and this still this is still there i don't know what to do with that it kind of matches the room because it's black so i just kind of left it but i am going to later change out these light bulbs if you guys know some good white light light bulbs that's not like the spiral ones please let me know um <clears throat> the tabletop only has my brushes and it only has my mirror and these few things this is just my cotton swabs and my um sponges and a candle from shea moisture and of course i told you guys the clicker to the lights um <laughs> that's what it does so it controls the different ones one two three four um, I got this from Aldi during Christmas and since Christmas is coming back up if you guys wait during Christmas time they may have this again usually use it for like Christmas lights and we did last year um, but they're, they come with like four well three little things and you just plug whatever you want to have on and off like Zoe's nightlight is one of them and you can control it from any room in the house let me show you the drawers because I'm pretty sure you guys want to know what happened or want to see how, I, how it looks. The first drawer here is my everyday kind of makeup stuff. It kind of still looks a little disheveled a little bit. But my brow kit, some primers, you know, some creams. And this has all my mascaras and eyeliners and then nail stuff and my floss because I floss every night. My, glass case, my glasses case and just some little you know pencil sharpeners things that i use i can grab really fast like eyebrows and tweezers and stuff so this drawer didn't change much it's just how i kind of organize it and i did add this stuff in here but it looks so much better <laughs> this drawer is still my foundation drawer and powders but i added my face primers in this drawer and i gave my concealers a little bit more space because as you guys saw i was trying to give the concealers its own thing but it just wasn't working out so i just gave it more space since i have less powders and i'm hoping soon i'm going to get more powders and then we'll kind of rearrange it as i go and maybe throw something away if i get something new and then all my foundations are back there it is going to be a pain to have to reach but if i take this one out i should be able to get to my foundations really easily but i can see all of my foundations like i use this one every day i can tell what they are from just the bottle so i should be okay here is all of my lipsticks you guys are probably wondering what happened to all the lipsticks out of the acrylic things so here they are it's not the best organization thing but it works like it has all my nudie pinks my browns my reds all the different like weird colors like purple greens grays are here and then these are all the little samples and lip glosses i love this one it's the dolly one from boxum um and then these have all the samples and then these are all the who is this by um measurable measurable difference they're all back here and then all the way back there are my lip liners um they're all the way in the back which is fine because i haven't been using a lot of them lately anyways but this is all my lipsticks i did get rid of a bunch of lipsticks and i was happy that they all fit in this one drawer this drawer has all the lashes the blushes and the highlighters so all my lashes are right here i don't have a ton i'm just now getting into lashes these are some of my highlighters these are blush and highlighter palettes right here this is some highlighter and contour palettes here more blushes 
blushes and highlight well blushes and highlighters and face sprays and back all the way back there are my individual eyeshadows i'm not really using them at the moment so they stay in the back because i don't really use individual eyeshadows anymore so that is this whole drawer here um it's really easy because like i can fit more stuff in here i can just slide stuff down and i have so much more room to grow in the last drawer over here is my palace drawer so this whole stack like this whole thing is profusion then i have some of my smaller palettes here another profusion but then some smaller ones here um it's my ray ray and just those palettes and then here are my longer palettes here and just some of my palettes that just wouldn't fit back there um mac and stuff like that this is one of my profusion palettes that i had to kind of diy because it kind of messed up in the packaging you can see that it's still breaking in here which is so sad because i love this palette it's the superstars one i just kind of put it in its own thing and that's probably what was like all over the bottom see it's all over the place and then all of these besides this these two are my bh cosmetics there's like a little pile and then these are some concealer palettes back there up here are is all my skincare like everyday skincare just skincare in general so back there are all my face masks you guys can't tell but if i move this there's like all the eye mask and that's just the butt mask but these are all my eye mask and these are all my face masks so i have a good stack of mask back there i couldn't figure out how to fit this in here nicely but yeah i don't know we're still trying to work on this section but these are my moisturizers here and toners here all of that's right here here are all my little face masks that's in jars so i keep them here because i use these all the time each one and these are my small like samples small um face moisturizers small little mask just everything that's tiny is right in this little guy right here so and then here's my little eye mask thing but all my face care is right in that drawer there now down here is all my body care this is all like my lotions witch hazel um just this is for the face but i couldn't fit it up there so i'm just gonna act like that's not there same thing for this deodorants and back here are like other lotions that i don't use all the time except for the aquaphor but it just fits in there and i kind of just had this little up down thing going on but that's pretty much what's in this drawer and i can fit a few more things in there you know and this drawer is kind of like the hair drawer kind of <laughs> jewelry situation my like wig caps and my clips like my clips and stuff is here the got to be gel that i use on my wig like every day comb brush extra wig caps my wraps my bonnet will be in there my got to be spray sunglasses that i use all the time and just some extra jewelry that i may or may not wear i'm not sure and then my versace glasses because i wear those a lot as well so i kind of want to have everything that i use all the time in these drawers it's all of my my uh technical stuff my electronics they were in this drawer and it was a hot mess so now it's really organized so all the cords and charger things are here my old camera is back there and the older and then the other camera is back there somewhere and then my extra plug in my speaker my extra um backup drive hard drive tripods like this is the car one um and then i have my handheld tripod right there with the light on it my headphones that i edit with my other hard drive that this is the main one that i edit with my speaker to do like voiceovers it's in its own case and then i added one for headphones because i have like a lot of these i have three more pairs in the living room which i'm going to add to this but i have a lot of little apple headphones so that's in there batteries and memory cards literally like all my rechargeables are right here and then this is just some plugins like you know the things that you like plug everything in besides this this is for my camera that i'm using right now but these all are like plug-in things 
right there so everything has a place everything looks good i'm super happy i can access everything and i can see all of my electronics and i know where everything is final and last drawer is basically miscellaneous stuff because of course everyone has to have one of those drawers this is just an extra spin brush here this is a bag holder for when i do makeup some extra pads i have no idea what these are i know they're for the camera thing but i don't know what, what this is for i kind of know what this is for but i just kind of threw it in there because it didn't really have a place some led lights that couldn't fit in this drawer here this extra bag and everything else back here is just boxes from my um hard drives that i like to keep and some manuals that's it that's that's it there's nothing fancy about this stuff so that's it guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys liked my little organization it literally took me six hours to do all this i didn't think it was going to take that long but it did it took a long time i hope you guys like the, like the before and after leave a comment down below if you know some good light bulbs i can change out and also if you want to want me to see your transition or transformation of your vanity um let me know and leave a comment down below let me know how you feel about it if you like it give this video a thumbs up and i can't wait to chat with you guys in my next video bye guys okay guys you guys are already here so don't forget to click down below and subscribe and click that notification bell to get a notification when i post a new video and check out some of my latest videos like this one you see here